Welcome back, everyone. This is Cody with Wrangler Barn. I've had several people ask me, um, you know, what is this room that I keep filming in? And it's my photo studio. I have a, a pro professional photo studio in my shop. I do uh, quite a bit of photography, product photography, and weddings and events and different things, and kind of as a hobby. Um, so I'll show you around a little bit. The um, this is a room that I you'll see me film in a lot. Um, I have a little kind of a, a table here and all my little projects set up here. And I like to work in here because it has nice light. Uh, so it's a pretty small room. So if you've seen these lights, um, I have three photography style lights. They're uh, uh, made by Alien Bees. And typically these will stand up on a tripod system, but I just don't have room to have th four tripods in here. By the time you have uh, three lights and a tripod for your camera, it's, there's just no room to work in here. So what I've done is I've built this overhead rail system. If you can see it or not, I'll try to demonstrate it. But how it works is each light is mounted on this accordion style mount. So. I can infinitely adjust these things whichever I want. And then they swivel and they also roll on the tracks from side to side. And then the main tracks also roll forward or backwards. So I can position any one of these lights pretty much anywhere in the room for whatever I want to shoot. I have uh, another one over here and then let me snap off the tripod. I've got, uh, and then I've got one right here. It's a pretty small room, but you can see the rail system there. It really works slick. It keeps everything up overhead and uh, no tripping. Because when you have a, uh, I mean, you just, just take this camera for example. You have a pro professional camera like this sitting on a tripod. You have $1,500 into a body, you have uh, $300, $300 into a vertical grip, and $1,500, $1,600 into a lens, just kicking one of those tripods over, this thing is probably a goner, so I really enjoy having the overhead. It's uh, paid for itself, I'm sure, many times over. Uh, another thing that's kind of cool, you might find it interesting, let me move this over here is the backdrop system. I'm almost always going to shoot on against a white or a black backdrop. And this is just some heavy duty photographer paper and these are on uh, these reels here. So I pull this down and uh, have my back black background Obviously, with the So that saves a lot of time and it's very convenient and handy. I can put a third one on there for uh, if I wanted to do another color, another colored background. But that's essentially it. The uh, cameras are all activated, or the, or the, the strobes are all activated with the camera. You just have to plug in the uh, patch cord here and it will. Uh, activate the master and then the other two, the forward flashes, will, uh, will uh, fire off of a photocell. They have a, a little sensor in there and uh, they can pick up that first flash and, and complete the exposure. So if you see me in here and wondering what these lights are doing hanging around here, you now you have a pretty good idea. This is uh, the Wrangler Barn Photo Studio. Some of you might be interested in this. But thanks for watching. Thanks for your patience if you weren't interested in I'll have something better coming up really soon. Thanks. Bye.